Hello, this is Nikki. Um, now this blog is um, one where I'm looking a bit rough. I've had a, a long day at work and I've not been very well with the gastric balloon for a couple of weeks. So I thought it was important that I told you about this so that it doesn't happen to any of you. I'd rather it happen to me. So the weight loss has been going well. I've lost over three stone now. I have lost three stone, three pounds or something. But the last couple of weeks I've felt dreadful. And um, I spoke to Julia in Birmingham and I spoke to one of the gastric balloon nurses who was lovely. They're so nice. If anything worries you, ring them and they'll put you on the, the right track. So what was happening is I was feeling very sick all the time and I've not managed to hold much food down any food or water really and um, hence why I feel I look horrible and I've had a big day at work so what's happening is that I'm producing I'm coughing a lot of white frothy nastiness and I looked into it and it's to do with GERD which is gastro gastrointestinal reflux disorder so you produce a lot of acid and um, obviously that's not sitting very nice on your tummy now we're told to take a meprazole and a meprazole helps prevent this but a meprazole makes me feel sick so I've not been taking it so after speaking to the ladies there's another there's an alternative called lansoprazole so my doctors prescribed uh, me some lansoprazole and another medication just bear with me which is called metochloropramide metochloropramide which is what you're given when you first have the balloon fitted and that will help ease digestive transit through your system because apparently what we think's happened is the balloons got dislodged at the base of my tummy so the food sitting on top, I can't digest it and then I'm producing a lot of acid anyway because I'm not controlling it with the omeprazole and I'm being quite poorly. So I have felt really rotten actually. So um, I'm going to let you know how I get on with these, um, these new medications and I was also told to massage my tummy upwards towards my left um, shoulder to try and push the balloon, it won't do it any damage, push it out of the way so that the food can get past. So I'm hoping I'll feel a lot brighter and look a lot better because I don't think I've ever looked this rough in a long while. So okay, might be a bit skinnier but not feeling very good. So I'm going to let you know how I get on because I want this to happen to me and not you. Alright, so um, don't let it put you off. I'm really pleased with the balloon because without it I wouldn't have shifted the three um, over three stone in just over three months okay but so I'm really chuffed with that people don't recognize me well they don't recognize me today because I look rough but they um wow that that was a, such a boost when people are commenting all the time it's lovely so don't let me put you off the gastric balloon let me just tell you what's happened to me and then don't let it happen to you obviously contact the girls if you're not happy because they will give you some fantastic advice. I'm just a wally. I think I'm stronger than I am. But it was obviously being sick a lot and not feeling very nice isn't pleasant. So I had to ring the girls today. And they told me off. They said I should have contacted them sooner. Which, of course, in hindsight, I should have done. So I'll let you know how I get on. Okay? All the best. Bye.